Hello there YouTube, welcome back. Jay, Flip Vapor, got another e-juice review for you today. We have the legendary e-juice, Looper, by Philip Rock, part of his animal range. Let's see if we can get this little bitch to focus. Yeah, there we go. Lovely packaging. Lovely display. Really, really clean. Comes in 30 millilitre dripper style bottles, a glass dripper, child proof safety cap. Comes in 3, 6 and 12 nick and he's just brought out 1.5 as well which is really really nice if you're obviously trying to get off the, uh, the higher nicotine ratings. Um, I'll pick this up from number one e-juice in the UK. It retails about 14.99, probably maybe even cheaper other places because I know that it's flooding into the UK market at the moment. It's got great reviews. If you believe all the hype and the reviews, you believe you'd be vaping on unicorn piss. But yeah, I'm not believing the hype. I picked up a bottle myself and I've been vaping it for two or three days, something like that. And as you can see by the amount that's still left in the bottle. There we go. Let's see if you can see that. Yeah. I'm liking it. It's nice. Really nice. I'm a dessert style vapor anyway. I'm a proper little dessert fiend, so I do like the sweetness. Um, when I heard about this and I read the reviews, I thought, yeah, I've got to pick a bottle up. Um, so I've got to see if the hype is actually true. You, you know what it's like in the uh, the e-juice vaping industry. There's a shit ton of hype, and some juices just don't fulfil and they don't, just don't come through. But this one for me, very very nice. The description is a like the smell of a freshly opened box of Fruit Loop fruity cereal, which when you sniff it, it smells exactly like that. It's, 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 it's what it says is exactly. Exactly it. It is definitely a box of Fruit Loops. When you first open them, give them a sniff. That's the smell. Definitely the smell. Um, I've had a few Loop style e juices before. Some of them could be really, really citrusy, really, really limey. Um, but this one it is smooth as shit. Um, really, really nice and free nick. Hardly any throat here. Doesn't get sticky over time. So you could probably vape it all day if you've got the same sort of taste buds as I have. But yeah. I'm going to stop rambling on like an old man and we'll drip the shit up and we'll have a little two. Using the old Fateful Hobo V3.1 with the uh, Sub Home Innovations Sub Zero mod. Got a review coming up on the channel of these two little bitches soon. So subscribe, stay tuned if you want to see that shit. Right, let's have a drip up. Build I've got in here today is basic bitch build to be fair. It's 24 gauge camp file, 7 wraps, 0.35 ohm, round, wraps around a 2.5mm screwdriver, Japanese cotton wick. Basic. Really good vapour. It doesn't actually say on the bottle, and I can't find anywhere to say what the PGVG ratio is, but if you have a look at it, it looks to be about either a 70-40 or an 80-30, really, the way, the, the, way the, the liquid pulls in the actual bottle. I would say more of a 70-30, to be fair. But like I said, I can't find any information to say otherwise, really. That's just my personal opinion. But yeah, great vape, really, really smooth, um, really good flavour picture. Some of the the fruit loopy vapes I've had, like I said, have been really, really citrusy, really, really lemony. Uh, but this one seems to calm it down, and you do get the fruit loopy style vape, but you get the milkiness, you get the creaminess on the exhale as well, which is really, really nice. Let's have number two before I wet myself. Yeah, really nice. This one's in free nick. No fr fuck all throat here. Really, really smooth. Doesn't tinkle, uh, tickle your tonsils when you've obviously running it sub. Yeah, great vapor, great flavor. Definitely an all-day vape for me, and definitely one that I will buy again. Quite expensive, obviously 14.99, but that's sort of the price in the UK for. 
premium USA e-juices. E if you want the decent flavours that they produce and stuff like that, then you've got to pay the price. And 14.99 seems to be the the sort of price for the premium stuff now. But if you're on the fence and you don't know whether to buy a bottle, because obviously it's a bit of a expensive 14.99 just for a punt for a bottle to be sitting on the side, 30 millilitres and doing fuck all, then if you've got taste buds like me, which is a dirt dessert cereal fiend, then you'll love this shit. It's, it's really, really nice. I pick up the bottle straight away. Like I said, I got this from Number One E-Juice in the UK. There's a few other vendors doing it, but they're all around the same price. But Number One E-Juice, put your order in. It come next day, basically. They're really, really good. But yeah, cheers for watching YouTube. If you like the video, obviously hit the like button. If you like what we'll do on the channel, hit the subscribe button. If you've got any comments or anything like that, whack us a comment in the comment box below. Cheers for that. See you later.